Since 2015, the Keystone exam, the standardized test Pennsylvania uses to evaluate students' proficiency in core subjects, has not been required. Yet the state continues to pay millions of dollars every year to administer them. And now some state leaders are calling for a change. Eyewitness News State Capitol reporter Matt Heckel explains. In a special report released Wednesday, Auditor General Eugene DePasquale points out the Pennsylvania Department of Education is paying tens of millions of dollars every year to a Minnesota-based company to administer and score the Keystone exams, despite not being federally required since 2015. It's been four years and will cost taxpayers nearly $100 million by the end of the contract for tests our students do not even need to take. In his report, De Pasquale recommends replacing the Keystone exam with the SAT, a nationally recognized test he says would save money. We could instead give the SAT to all students and still save at least $1 million a year. In Pennsylvania, Keystone exams are just one part of a broader system of education. Matthew Stem with the Department of Education says over the last three years, they've actually reduced the cost of standardized testing, including the Keystone exams, by 30 percent. And while they're open to discussing a change, they say the Keystone exam is the only one that meets the state's current standards. If we were going to look at other, any other assessment other than Keystone exams, it would be important for us to engage stakeholders and make sure that that assessment is aligned to Pennsylvania's standards. In Harrisburg, Matt Heckel, Eyewitness News.